everybody, and welcome back to another episode of The Cultural World Plays H1C1. I am joined by my co-host here, Mr. Reconnaissance Sniper, or Will, and I am your host, Balthazar or Steven. How you doing, Will? I'm doing pretty good, Steven. How about yourself? Hey, man, I'm good. All right, so last time we left off, we went into the dam. Dude, there was a zombie straight up sprinting at me, and he's, like, got fumes and shit coming off of him. Dude, you gotta see this. Dude, come here. Dude. Yeah, I'm looking at him, bro. I'm looking at dude, him. This is, <laughs> dude, this is horrifying. <laughs> Should dude, I shoot him? Dude, no. Just run. Just run. I've never seen this before. Don't shoot him. Run. Don't waste the bullet, because you'll pull all the other zombies on us, oh, and there could be more. Oh, dude, he's so scared. Dude, all right. Oh, I'm going to... Oh, dude. Oh, dude, 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 bro. Dude, he fucking exploded. What he's... the... I'm so glad you didn't stop to shoot him. We would have fucking died. He did 80... He did 20% health damage to me. That was the most fucked up shit of all time. I... I... Dude, I'm so glad we got that on camera. What the fuck, bro? Oh my god. I've never seen that, but wait, hold on. Does he drop loot? <laughs> hold on, wait a sec. <laughs> I don't think he drops any loot. Let's go, hold on, let me see if he drops any loot. I think point in one of the buildings over here. Alright, so our next stop, we're going to Pleasant Valley and then Camp Bastion. Pleasant Valley, though, we will, that's where we will see people. And the people that go into Pleasant Valley are like the people that live in this game, like the hackers and shit, so... Just don't engage any of them. We want to sneak in and sneak out. And then the whole, and, and the reason why I don't want to engage, I'll, I'll explain. Basically, if we die right now, we lose everything. Like, everything that we have, and we have to start from zero. But if we can kind of accrue enough shit and build a base, then, you know, we'll be able to... At least if we die, we won't have to start completely over. No, I definitely understand. I'm 100% with you. You know, it's one of those things, you know, where you really have to get your foot in the door. And you, even if we live in a one by one shack, you know, we at least we have our foot yeah, in the dude. door. Yeah, uh, dude. What are you doing? Are you ready? I'm healing right now. Oh, for sure. Yeah, dude. That's dude. That zombie actually scared the shit out of me. Like no yeah, joke. Bro, like dude, I was at 38 percent. I had never seen that before ever. Like I've I, that was horrifying. That was actually horrifying. I mean, hey, kudos to them for putting in more zombie types, but, yeah. like, that was horrifying, dude. That actually <laughs> scared the shit out of me. All right, so I'll cover you. Story. All right, man. All right. Uh, I, I spent my last bandage on that. Probably going to end up at 80, uh, 82 Here, come here. Come here. I got more. You're going to stand out in the middle of the open no, scene? No, just grab that shit. Uh, my bad, but, yeah. Just grab those bandages. Yeah, dude, I don't even want to stand in the middle of the open because he's fucking zombies, bro. That scared that dude. At that last one, I was like, why is he fucking smoking? What is the what is wrong with the zombie that he's got smoke coming off him? Why? In the, and then he exploded, and I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> Thanks, H1. All right, you ready? Hey, let's go. All right, for sure. So we're gonna avoid the road. Uh, actually, we have to take the road because through here, there's really not a way we can get to the Pleasant Valley. I would like a car. I have a vehicle battery on me, but pretty much if we use a car, it's going to be like literally one trip because we don't have a base to like hold it. So it'll just kind of vanish. Sure. I really can't wait for us to get this base going, man. I hope Bro, by the end we'll of the episode we'll have that started. We will get this shit going. Like I said, once we have military backpacks... Uh, maybe a ghillie suit for you or something. That'd probably be good. I mean, but that's for right now. Like I said, we're, we're pretty well armed. We both got good guns. We got, you know, helmets each. Oh, yeah, uh, one thing I, off camera, after we stopped recording, I, I found a helmet. There it is right there. Um, picked that up last time after we killed the zombie. It was, like, sitting in the water two feet away from us, so I went and just beat it up with a spear and grabbed it. So, not super, you know, thrilling or important, but just so everybody knows. And there's a little food right here. Make sure, keep an eye on your energy and shit like that. Just watch it. I actually need to get that up as well. Here. What's it at? What's it at? Uh, energy's at 24%. Hydration's at 30 Uh, drink Here, that. I have some barbecue chicken. No, yeah, eat the barbecue chicken and drink that bottle of water. That barbecue chicken sandwich sounds pretty bomb right now, Dr myself. Yeah. Drink that bottle. Not, uh, Hurry up. I'm, I'm, drinking the, I'm drinking the water, bro. True. All right, okay. and make sure you grab the empty bottle. I got the empty bottle. All right, for sure. My guy. My guy. Hell yeah. All right, let's go. Mm, 
Watch out for those watchtowers. I just make sure there's no one in them. I'll take a quick peek with the binoculars and always just kind of scout it and see what's up. We're not going to loot these cabins. Stay away from them. They're always like booby traps. So like you'll go in and step on a landmine or some bullshit. So just don't even. Are we bother. able to scavenge landmines? To what? The scavenge landmines. No. Once they're deployed, then you can't scavenge them. Uh, and if you go, and they're super glitched, so if you go within like 30 feet of them, they'll just blow up and kill you. They're instant kill, and they destroy all your uh, equipment and loot that's on you, so... It's real bad. Real bad. Yeah, Pleasant Valley was where I fucking died last time, right outside of the fire station trying to get military backpacks. Literally, I heard gunshots, and I was like, oh, I'll run over here, and I'll, you know, fight this guy, because I got a gun. And he killed me with a machete. <laughs> so, you know, that's the game. H1Z1. That's H1Z1 in a nutshell. Alright, let me... Uh, I can't really get a bead on, like, if this base is active, but it looks, looks alright. Looks like it'll be fine. It'll be all right. I think. <laughs> Famous last words. So you've been reading any comics lately? Yeah, man. I actually was in on... So Miles Morales' uh, Spider-Man's real good. Uh, Captain Marvel, the Carol Danvers Captain Marvel's real good. Um, Have you read I any of the all-new X-Men yet? Uh, I don't really like the all-new X-Men. I think it's okay. Like, I like that they brought Jean Grey back. The best X-Men comic that's out right now, I, I guess it's more of a Wolverine comic, is Old Man Logan. Old Man Logan's fucking amazing. Like, every yeah. every issue of the nine issues right now, and I've, I've got all of them, uh, is really, really good. I really enjoyed it. And then Contest of Champions was fun. That was a good little side story. And Civil War 2. I'm really enjoying Civil War 2 right now. Oh, yeah. And then, like, I'm popping in and out of the Rebirth stuff, but the DC Rebirth, but honestly, like, I'm just bored as hell by it. Like, oh, and, and Deadpool Mercs, Mercs, uh, Mercs for Money. Or Deadpool and the Mercs for Money. Really enjoying that. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, I'm reading, you know me, bro. Comic book buff, reading up on, like, everything. You know how it is, dog. You know, your boy. It's your boy. It's mm -hmm. your boy, Stevie. What up? It's Stevie Dog. That's, uh, you catch my mixtape, Young Flames. La Flame. So, what is your name? Atai Daoma? Like, what's that like? Atai Daoma. Fuck is that? Bro, it's the first name I got in Star Wars Galaxy way back in the day, bro. That's my only username ever since. Yep. <laughs> bro. I swear, I swear that like, I did a random name generator and I was like, alright, that's my username. Alright. I, just, I hey, just kept it. Bro, no shit. That's how I got Balthazar. I actually did a random name generator in World of Warcraft. And when it came back, it was like, it was like Zario or, or Balthazario or something like that. And I changed it to this and then boom, there you go. Nice. So like... You know, it's how they should be. Um, no, that, what do you have? You nothing. have you have you seen who they cast as the new Captain Marvel? Um, I actually haven't. No. Uh, have you seen the new Doctor Strange trailer? I actually haven't watched that either. I've actually been living under what? a rock. Have you yeah. have you seen the new Luke Cage trailer? I actually haven't even seen that either. Bro, I'm gonna kill you. Uh, so all three. So Brie Larson is playing. Captain Marvel, which I think is really cool. She she fits the part, looks good, and with the like winning streak that Marvel's been on lately, I expect her to do really well. Luke Cage looks phenomenal. Uh, I'm just very excited for that. And Doctor Strange, I, I was a little hesitant of Benedict Cumberbatch at first because like, you know, how, how should I put it? Like Stephen Strange is like a lot older, so I was like, well, maybe. If Cumberbatch, they, they put him in makeup and whatever, then maybe it'll look a little bit different. But actually, seeing him in there and hearing his r voice and everything, I was like, man, you know, that's, uh, that's pretty good. Yeah, you know, I think uh, a, a lot of things with, like, Dr. Strange, I feel like he, he, his whole persona kind of, kind of fits in just kind of nicely. And it kind of 
Yeah, it makes a good uh, Doctor Strange for sure. He's, uh, and especially when I saw him in, in, dude, I gotta stop saying, uh, that's gotta be so annoying to listen to. He's really good. I saw him, they put the makeup, not makeup, but they put the gray streaks in his hair, like that Strange has on the sides of his hair, and that was really right. cool. So, I'm interested to see how he does. I think, I mean, it's been a Cumberbatch, so I think he'll do pretty well. I'm not quite sure exactly what the storyline is. I think it's the Doctor Strange origin, but it's going to be interesting to see for sure because they've never done the Doctor Strange origin in film before. And, well, they did it, like, in the, you know, the 80s or whatever, but that was when comic book films were just, like, bad. They weren't good. They were just kind of campy and shitty. So I'm curious to see with nearly a billion dollar budget in this thing how they do. Dying? You alright? Oh my god. <coughs> do I gotta put you down, bro? You got the virus? Oh man. You got, you got the virus, bro? You gotta die? Yeah, dude. Alright, let's yeah, head out. Exactly. <laughs> Shit. Screw Alright, let's. So we're headed towards Camp Bastion right now. And okay. the fire station. The fire station is up this way. Camp Bastion has the military backpacks, like I mentioned. Sometimes it has, like, tactical helmets. And it also has ghillie suits. Okay. Which, ghillie suits are, are really good for, like, sniping and shit like that. We might even be able to find... If I can find a sniper rifle, bro, we're set. Like, we're set. And then I'll give you this pistol. And you can get rid of that jank-ass R380. R380. Wait, I just heard... I think I heard a gunshot. Hold on. No, don't stop in the middle of the street. Get over here. Get low. What are you doing? Let's turn it up what is that? Yo, you got noise playing. What is it? Did uh, you turn it... the music off? No, it was just a game. Yeah, turn the music off, bro. One second. Alright. Because that shit's like... It's loud, always. It's not very good. The ambient? Just, uh... Hold on, we're in a bad spot. Um, it is... So, in... I got it. Yeah, just turn the music volume to zero. Alright, let's go. Alright, 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 alright. <clears throat> so just be on the lookout for gunshots. The, the way you win gunfights in this game is whoever sees the other group first. So if like, you hear a gunshot and we can get an eye on them before they can get an eye on us, we can just fire on them and we'll win. But okay. if they see us before we see them, they'll obviously have the element of surprise and then we're dead. <laughs> so, And we want to be in here as little as possible. Like, maybe not even two, three minutes. Because okay. there's hordes of zombies here and they'll just chew our asses up. I can imagine so. In a non-sexy way. Yeah. Dude, I want to watch... I, I need to, like, sit down, because I haven't seen the Batman vs. Superman Ultimate Edition, which is, like, the director's cut, because the movie right. was bad. But they... The director's cut adds a bunch of... Uh, how should I say? Like, context and things. Right. So, basically, it adds a bunch of, like, really important scenes that were cut from the movie, and it's, like, four hours long, almost. And I... But I just, like don't have four hours to sit and watch a movie like I'm too busy and uh, I just can't make myself do that all right so in here dude you are so far behind what the fuck oh yeah, I was uh yeah doing you know oh my god uh all right let's loot this shit quick keep it just watch my back while I get through these lockers uh... dude oh my god this Glitch of like something in the way. Watch out. No, don't um, don't do that for real. You could scare the shit out of me. Oh my god. Because one day you're gonna be like, there it is. I'm gonna be like, yeah, okay. And they're gonna fucking shot fucking murder this. us. I think I got something that says one small shack. You built a small shack? I found one in this tool cabinet. Oh shit! Take that. Hell yeah. All right. So no military backpacks here. That fucking sucks. Yeah, dude, take that shack. Hell yeah, we could use that and build our base. Shack, yeah. Yo, we gotta go. We gotta go. Why? I just heard something. We gotta leave. Wait. Shit. Uh, back towards the east behind us. Come on. 
Come on. I'm trying, bro. Oh shit. Are we gonna, are we gonna get I heard like a lot of gunfire. Like it sounded like maybe five people. Really? Yeah, dude, that was not good. And then like a weird gust of like ambient wind and then I get I always shows my gut in this game. Cause I, I get a bad feeling and thirty seconds later there's a gunfight or something erupting right where I was and I'm like, Well, that's instinct. Yeah, that's very true. So I also grabbed the fire axe. Which is great for chopping down trees. And that's all we need to be doing. And is chopping some well, you have a small shack now, which is super important. Because we can leave our characters in the shack and hopefully it won't get busted. Yeah. And I, I, know, a, I know a place where we can actually build it. I don't know. We, we might have to Skyrim up this mountain. Yeah, you have to Skyrim up the mountain. Um, so, I love how you know what I meant by that. <laughs> so, um, we, the area we need to go to, to actually put the, like, shack down and everything. Yeah, it's... my character is saying he's tired. Oh, god damn it. Alright, uh, we'll have to rest when we get to Camp Bastion. There's nowhere to rest anywhere for a while. So you're just gonna make my character be tired, too. <laughs> Pretty much, man. You're kind of, you're kind of screwed, bro. You're gonna have to deal with it. Maybe you tell your character to stop being such a little bitch. Oh shit! What is it? Hey, there might be a bed in here. The base. Yeah. You think we'll be able to gain access to the base? No, unless I can maybe jump right here. Ah, it's a little too high. Can you pick oh. me back up? Uh. I made it. Ah, god damn it. Alright, hold on. One more time. Ooh. No, alright, let me let me try. I don't think I can piggyback off of you, but... Uh, yeah, no, because it does, like, the falling animation. So you gotta just get, like, a running start, and you gotta jump at the right point. So, like... Not right there, I fucked it up. Like, right here. Oh, ow. Damn them. That was close. I know. All right, we'll give it like another couple tries, and then I'm, um, and then this is a little ridiculous. All right, I gotta eat. I gotta eat some blackberries. Drink some. Hey, you, I made, made, it. you made it. All right, yeah. see if there's a bed in there. Careful. Should I look for pe people. Careful, there's not. Wait, say what? Should I look for people? I can't. Oh, look for people. There's no one in there. This base has been raided. Yeah, so we should take it over. That's not how that works. You can't build on a deck that you don't uh, that you don't own or you can't claim. So like, I can't claim this deck. See, here's their shack over here. This is where they live. So they're building this base, but their shack is right there. Okay. Yeah, I don't see any beds in there. Yeah, because they're not on. All right, let's leave. What are you? All right, let's go. I was like, "What in the world?" Uh, let's head up this way. All right. I was like, "What in the world are you doing?" Yeah, I'm just trying to rub my nose, man. My no, nose I, you good, my G? You good? You good, dog? Dude, these yeah. deer. Oh, my God. One of these deer is going to get shot. One of these. This is a small shack right here. This is an example of a small shack. There's nothing in there. So ghetto. Uh, um, where is Camp Bastion? It's close. I believe it's... Down this hill. It's been so long since I've been over here. And a lot of this game is uh, is almost a walking simulator in which you just kind of roam around and you know 
We actually haven't yeah. seen anybody, but we are playing pretty late at night, so I guess that's probably a, a reason for nobody being around. One of them, anyway. That yeah. the game is dying. That's another one, too. Mm, how's your energy and hydration looking? Uh, energy 36, hydration 36 as well. Yeah, that's not great. Mine's are out about the same, so we'll probably have to see if we can get some food in Camp Bastion. Uh, there's the road. Okay, so we're we're close. We're very close. You could probably grab some of these sticks while you're running, so you can get I've some arrows. I've some. All right, for sure. Yeah, that way you got some arrows. Now, of all the places where we haven't seen people, I actually fully expect Camp Bastion to have people, because typically that place, and it might even have a vehicle, but I doubt it. Okay. Strongly, strongly doubt it. Man. Dude, I am starving. I had Chipotle earlier. I love Chipotle. Uh, and I went to... Uh, the last time I was out in your areas, I went to uh, Brada's. I love Brada's, man. Brada's is good. I appreciate you showing me that place. Uh, for those who don't know or don't have a Brada's or have never been to a Brada's, Brada's is a chain restaurant in Las Vegas that has basically Hawaiian-style Chipotle. So if you enjoy Chipotle and you enjoy sweeter meats and things like that, that has brought us. It's real good. I, I quite enjoy it. I quite enjoy it. Oh, yes, my friend. Alright, and then it should be right down the cell. Man, what are you doing in there? Are you, are you slamming your face down on the desk? Jeez. You know, I've just been having this. You know, just light cough. I don't know what's going on. Bro, <laughs> Sound like you like beating your face on the desk, bro. I'm worried about you. You alright? You doing good? Doing well, dog. Uh, there's the bridge, so it's over here. I think you're gonna dig this military encampment. I don't think you've ever been here. We can't build a base here just because there's yet yeah, right here. There it is. Uh, I don't see anyone at that base up there, but that doesn't mean that there's no one there. This is a great place to build a base because essentially you have a run of this camp. Mm -hmm. And, I mean, you're not really near anything. You're near Pleasant Valley, but also, like, this camp can serve as a pretty good foraging spot for weapons and whatnot. Right. Also, there's two bases being built. And it looks like neither of them is active. All right, be on your toes. Okay. Guns ready. Sun's out, guns out, babe. Sun's out, guns out. Yeah, and I found a two, two, three bullet back at that uh, fire station. At a boy, where are you headed? Hey, over here, over here. Hello, hello. I was taking the plank, bro. <laughs> no, man. There's only one entrance. You can't take the plank. <laughs> I was gonna meet you around the other side to make sure he was gonna. There, start. there is no other side. There's only one entrance. I was gonna run around and meet you at the front. I hear a wolf. Wolf better not buck with me, man. I'll hack him to death. Okay. Let's look around. So, I haven't been here since they redid it. So, I don't really know where all the loot is. So, I guess be on the lookout for maybe a car. If not a car, look for lockers. There's a lot of vehicle parts here. It's a baseball bat, but who cares? Baseball bats do like no damage. There's an MRE. And a couple lemon pepper tuna. That actually sounds really good right about now. Yeah, dude, I gotta get some food when we're done recording here. Oh, hey, Pater. Hello. Oh, it's empty. Son of a bitch. But there's food. Lots of food. There's a lot. Dude, there's so much food here, actually. This is perfect. I gotta eat and drink. Just kind of cover my back, and, and I'll cover yours, and we make sure no one's uh, no one's rolling up in here. Mm. Oh, it takes so long to eat. Why? Why? Uh, 
Okay. Yeah, that's good. Check the area. Hmm. We gotta check all these tents. What's in here? I guess there is a back way now. I, huh. There wasn't before. That's interesting. This is like a vehicle repair place. Or like a storehouse or something. I'm not sure. That is a stun grenade right here. And your guy is breathing so hard. Yeah, he's, he's like, pretty tired. He's like, he's like <gasps> mm -hmm. uh, nothing so far. Yeah, his stamina is really low. Yeah, because you keep holding shift to run around, and then your uh, hydration and your energy are probably super low. So, my energy is at 64, but my hydration is Yeah, you don't start regening until you're back at 100%. Ah, this is what we're looking for. Hello. All right, Kevlar. Kevlar. Nothing. Nothing. A ghillie suit. Hey, you want a ghillie suit? This is what it looks like. There's some Kevlar. Here, this is... Look, you want this? Look. I'm in the... No, I'm, I'm, I'm right the I'm, I know. I'm right here. Hell yeah. You want it or no? Hell yeah. Alright, here. Damn, we got a wolf nearby. Here, I dropped the ghillie suit on the floor. Grab All it. Alright, I'll grab it. There's a lot of Kevlar, but not much else. And you put it over your shirt. <gasps> what the fuck? Why? Why? You shot. What happened? You shot. No, I didn't. Yes, dude, you shot me. No, I didn't, really? Yeah. I shot you? No, I think you missed, but it was close. You shot, like, right in front of me. Well, I don't know. My thing is glitching the fuck oh, out of me. Oh, my God. This is, <laughs> oh, I was just one word. Why? That's, that's all. Why? Every time, Steven. Every time we get anything going. Bro, bro <laughs> this is why we can't have nice things, bro. This is why we can't have nice things. There's also a know. shooting range here. That's be pretty fun. Nice. I don't really know what's in the shooting range, though. I don't think there's anything worthwhile, like guns or anything, but I've never really looted it, so. I feel like there should be bullets in these things. Nah, there's no bullets. My dude is dying, bro. Look at him breathing. Yeah, dude, because you keep. My stamina is at 0%, bro. Oh, because you have the glitch. You have the stamina glitch. They still haven't fixed from like four updates ago. Oh, hey, another helmet having zombie. Oh my god, dude, she's so fast! so fast dude I can't I can't hit her I can't hit her don't you dare shoot your gun I will end you I will end your life zombie got a spare helmet uh what do you got no I don't want to harvest it I want the motorcycle helmet fuck this vehicle battery I guarantee I'm not gonna find a car so have you ever checked in the towers here oh there's nothing in the towers Loot only. I know most of the loot spawns, and really they only spawn in the tents and shit. Mm -hmm. Uh oh, hey, there's lockers here. Maybe these lockers will have more loot. Or not, because they have the something is in the way glitch. Oh, oh, hey, if your guy needs to rest, rest in one of these beds. Oh, that's probably why you can't regen stamina. Your guy's probably fucking exhausted. Duh. Got the damn mil military backpack. You got a military backpack? Hell yeah! You find the others? Uh, just one. All right, well hurry up, hurry up and rest. I'm, I'm eating. All right, well rest before you. Oh, I got another military backpack. Hell yeah! Oh, that's so important. Oh, we can finally build a base. Oh, oh, oh thank God. All right, so we got everything on my grocery list. So that's pretty good. Uh, when we come back next time, we're going to start building our base, and we will make a little bit more progress. Once again, I appreciate everyone watching. Make sure you go to culturedworldblog.wordpress.com, twitch.tv slash culturedworldstreams, and also youtube.com. Search Cultured World Blog for all of our daily updates, uh, as well as videos and live content. So be sure you tune in. Uh, this is Will and myself, Balthazar or Steven, however you like to call me, signing off. See you next time.